Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome once again to Prime Time YouTube. Today is a very interesting topic, and it is a topic that we have been grappling with for quite a number of years. Now, Barbados is getting ready to step away from the ruling of the Queen. Let's go to the Gleaner newspaper and look at what is happening in Barbados. Barbados has announced its intention to become a republic and remove British Queen Elizabeth as head of state by November next year. Governor General Dame Sandra Mason gave the update this morning at the opening of a new parliament session in Bridgetown. She invoked the famous quote of the nation's first Prime Minister, Errol Barrow, who had cautioned against loitering and colonial premises. Having attained independence over half a century ago, our country can be in no doubt about its capacity for self-governance, said Queen Elizabeth representative, whose role is mostly ceremonial. The time has come to fully leave our colonial past behind. Barbadians want a Barbadian head of state. This is the ultimate statement of confidence in who we are and what we are capable of achieving, she said. Dame Sandra said the administration of Prime Minister Maya Motley will take the next logical step to make Barbados into a republic in time for the country's 55th anniversary of independence in November 21. The Governor General is duly bound to deliver the speech prepared by the political administration. In 1998, a Barbados Constitutional Review Commission recommended Republican status and in 2015, then Prime Minister Frondel Stewart said his administration would have implemented the recommendation. Most Caribbean community, CARICOM, states maintain formal links with the British monarchy after gaining their independence. If Barbados go through this with its plans, it will join Trinidad and Tobago and Guyana as members of CARICOM, big four to sever ties with the monarchy. Various administration of Jamaica, the fourth member have repeatedly said they would make Jamaica into a republic, but no steps have been taken to do so. Prime Minister Andrew Onis, who was last week sworn in for a second consecutive term, had committed to putting the issue along with major constitutional reform proposal to citizens in a grand referendum. The Queen is head of state for nine CARICOM member states, Antigua and Barbuda, the Bahamas, Barbados, Belize, Grenada, Jamaica, St. Lucia, St. Kiss and Nevis, St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Do you think Jamaica is about time we, we put the Queen aside and take governance of our own country? I personally support such a move. Why would we say that we are free and we are independent when we still have to answer to the Queen? I would love for someone to explain that to me. And I'm leaving this topic open for discussion. And I want all my fan base who are Jamaicans and those who are not to make your comment in the comment section below. Do you think Jamaica is ready to become a republic? Leave your comment in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and make your comment. And if you have not yet subscribed to my video, I would love for you to do so. Thank you so much.